got a YouTube question uh, from Cheese Dips asking about tucking elbows and how do you tuck your elbows. Um, I don't know, I never really had a problem with this, but some people have a natural tendency to bench with their elbows flared out here. I'd never felt comfortable like that. I've always felt more comfortable in here. Um, maybe it's from wrestling, always keeping your elbows in. I don't know. That is an awful ring to me. So, I guess a few tips that might help um, you to tuck your elbows better is, first off, have your lift-off person take the bar out further. Right? So most people, right, will set up the bars over their eyes and they take the bar out to like this far. And it's still like over their face. Right? Which is not a good position to bench from. Because then what happens, you start bringing it down and even if you start to tuck, it's, it's still kind of flaring. Right? So what you want to do is pull the bar out with the handoff guy and have him bring it out nice and far so it's over your sternum. Right? So it's over this part of your chest. Right? And then bring it down. And now my elbows are tucked. Good. Okay? It can come back a little bit on the way up, but I mean it's different with different people. But at the bottom you really want to have them tucked because you really want to protect your pack and your deltoid at the bottom of the bench where you're most prone to injury. So this is bad. Bad position for benching at the bottom. This is good position. Um, yeah, that's basically the easiest thing that I think you could do is have your handoff guy bring it out further. Um, other thing, make sure you concentrate on keeping your elbow under your wrist at all times, right? So I don't want to get in a position where my hand is coming back, kind of like an extension. And I don't want to get in the other way too, uh, kind of like a raise, right? So, wrist locked, elbow under the wrist, and tuck that elbow in and keep the wrist right above it. Um, some exercises that might help be like um, like a lat pull down, because when you pull down with where your elbows are, right? Doing a lat pull down trying to get real swole for the weekend and then look I bring my hands forward and where were they? The same exact spot where I benched from. Um, so that might help using a slingshot might help you to teach your teach you how to tuck your elbows because it kind of tucks your elbows for you. Uh, or if you're a cheapskate I guess you could like wrap a band around your um, elbows. Another, I'm trying to think of anything else that might help. Usually it's just cueing yourself to make sure the bar touches lower. Because you can't touch low with your elbows flare. Right? So just try and touch the bar a little bit lower. You shouldn't be touching up at your nipples, wherever your nipples are. Touch a little bit below your chest. Right here is where most people are. Um, if you have shorter arms, it's a little bit higher. If you have longer arms, maybe a little bit lower. But that's it. I hope that kind of clears that up. Um, yeah, have the handoff person bring the bar out further. Um, bring the bar to a lower spot. Concentrate on keeping your lats tight, like you're doing lat pull down. Um, and then make sure you're getting some like overhead pulling work and also even like rows and stuff too. That'll be helpful. Um, that's the best I can do. Like I said, it's always been natural for me to tuck my elbows, so maybe I'm not the best person to ask how to do it. Um, that's it. If anyone else has any questions, uh, send them to me. And yes, if you guys were wondering, this isn't a t-shirt. It's actually just body paint.